Hey everyone, I hope you're all right. It's Bradley from Haunted Nights. We're here doing our interactive ghost walk tonight. We've got some guests coming along all the way to Pendle Hill. Now, if you haven't heard that story, you need to go on our website and check it out. One of the most haunted stories in the whole of the north of England, all connected to witchcraft, mystery and suspicion. It all happened around here in 1612, all those years ago. Even today, people are still listening to the story and listening to the tragedy. It really happened in a small, tiny little village in literally the middle of nowhere as you guys can see i'm completely surrounded by woodland which is pretty nice this is our base this is just outside the village of barley which is one of the locations that we use when we do our interactive ghost tours it's the location we use when we do our ghost hunt as well and that's coming up in a couple of uh couple of months no next month i should say we have these events going on all year to be honest so we're looking forward to getting back especially to here to do the overnight ghost hunts now this location is supposed to be one of the most haunted places in the whole of lancashire now it started back here in 1612 with 12 innocent souls that were taken from this area accused of witchcraft taken to lancaster castle all the way up the m6 there and they were executed they were kept inside a tiny tiny little cell before they were taken to trial and they were all found guilty and it's also connected with the um the story of alice nutter who was arrested as well who was a catholic who came from roughly which is a local village not close uh, not too far from where i am now absolutely beautiful part of the world to be honest absolutely beautiful now as we're walking down this part now there's all manner of ghost stories that are attached to this area there's supposed to be a woman in white that's seen walking up this road ghostly children have been seen in the tree area hopefully you can hear me um yeah, ghostly children have been seen around the, the tree area we've got absolutely amazing responses to some of the dowsing rods and some of the uh you know, K2 meters that we use and uh, voice boxes, a load of spirit photography seems to be being taken at the moment. So even more of an excuse to get you out the house, get you down on one of our ghost hunts, one of our ghost walks that we have all over the whole UK. Now we have our YouTube channel, our Facebook, which is um, Haunted Nights Official keep looking over my shoulder because it is a very very spooky sort of place we also have our instagram feed a tiktok as well so hello to everyone make sure you subscribe and share all of the videos that are coming up now i'm going to go and check out this little location that is quite near to pendle near where i am now it's supposed to be some ghostly stories that are attached to it so i'm going to go and have a look i'm going to do some pictures and some videos and stuff like that and hopefully i'll be able to share you so see you later